Last episode we went PK and, and man did I have such a good time with that. Uh, we actually made money as well and um, I feel like I've, I've have done a little bit more since. I feel like I've got a little bit better as well and I've enjoyed it a lot more. But um, yeah, so uh, we also completed the Wilderness Diaries as well, which is quite a big thing for me for next time we go PK and, or even if I just want to go and uh, do some pet hunting in the wilderness, which uh, I do go kill a couple of KSLE and uh, you can see how that goes. So hopefully you enjoy and don't forget to subscribe. Did another PK trip, and uh, we didn't do as lucky this time, but we still at 1.6 mil, so that's definitely going to help with buying battle staffs at the minute. So I'm just uh, going to do a bit of bank standing and a bit of this, a bit of that. 81 crafting. Okay, so I think it's time. I'm sick of trying to put this thing on, and yeah, I can't do it. I've only got two quests to do, so it should only take me maybe a couple of minutes to do these quests, I think. Okay, that was super fast. I think we just talked to this person, and there we go. So that's Pokemon interest done. Uh, one quest left. This is literally gonna take like two minutes to do getting ahead. I don't know. I've never done this. Okay, that was getting ahead done. That was super super easy. That literally did take only a couple of minutes. Um, but yeah, we got uh, quite a bit of XP for the quest that it is, and I just realised I don't even have my quest cape on me. Okay, now hopefully I can wield my cape again. Yay! Oh, it just makes life easier for teleporting around and things like that. So uh, yeah, we have the quest cape back again. I don't feel as newbie. So I decided to go to Ellie and yeah, there was PKs about all over, but to be fair, as long as you stay quite calm and you remember to eat and change your prayers, literally it is not that difficult to escape from PKs. So um, yeah, I say that, but I, I did die a couple of times because, you know, clan man mode. So my plan is for now is to uh, just kind of AFK kill Chaos Ellie a little bit and, uh, you know, I have a play on the hardcore, watch a bit TV, that sort of thing, so I'm just going to keep doing that and I'm hoping one day I'm going to get the pet or even just like a good drop like a dragon pick or the uh, two-hander which would be pretty cool, but for now, yeah, I'm just going to AFK it, I'm not going to go hard trying to get the pet. Okay, so I decided I want to go for some stuff on the Slayer tab at the minute, so uh, I thought we'll start off easy and go for the bronze boot, it's 1 in 28 drop from these guys, so uh yeah, I think it should be pretty quick. Okay, so I'm at 131 kills. We've just gone over the drop uh, rate for it, and we're a little bit dry, but it's fine. I'm sure we'll get any second now. 211 kills later, and we finally get the bronze boots. I did not think it was going to take anywhere near this amount of time, but uh, now we've got them, let's go for the next boots. So our next monster to kill is Cockatrice, and they drop the Iron Boots, so it's a drop in 1, 2, 8 again, so let's try not to go too dry. Unbelievably, we've already got the, uh, we've already got the boots, 4kc. We will be back at some point though for the Cockatrice head, but for now, I just want the boots, so yeah, unreal. Okay, so that that was uh, too easy, so let's do the steel boots. It's the Pyrophenes next, also in the Slayer Tower. Uh, not Slayer Tower, in the Slayer Cave at, um, um, yeah, the place where we was at. So let's go see if we can get lucky. It's a drop of 1 in 2, 8 again. So, uh, yeah, hopefully, I, I want to say it'll be quick, but uh, who knows at the minute. Okay, that is the drop rate. Are we lucky? No. Um, yeah, so we're 1 to 8 now. How far are we going to go this time? Oh, there we go. Not too far over the drop rate, so that wasn't too bad at all. So uh, let me quickly pick them up to make sure they count. But uh, yeah, there we go. The steel boots. That was that was alright. That wasn't too bad. Um, I might have a quick look at the mithril, but um, I can't remember what drops it. It says jellies, but I'm sure there's something else that drops mithril boots. Um, but I can't remember what it is. Oh man, I was not paying attention at all, but we did just come in with uh, 92 strength a minute ago. Oh man, I missed it by a little bit as well, so uh, yeah, but we have came doing videos, so it's not my fault. I was checking there's no one else out there. I don't know. Oh, oh 35 shot. rubies. There's only three of them. They've got me. Oh, fuck. I didn't protect the items. Oh, fuck. <laughs> <I got me. laughs> 
Okay, so it's time to bring in some levels. So uh, I've been sat on this one for absolutely ages, but uh, 80 by Fletching, so now I can do the magic Lombos. So that's going to be a nice little XP upgrade. And also we're coming in with a crafting level, which uh, I'm going to carry on working with now. And this should be 82 magic coming in. Uh, teleport some people to Falado if we want. I'm um, just high elk and some staffs. And 83 crafting. Do a few more bits and pieces. Go, go, go. Fuck you out, oh, I've been frozen. Keep going, keep going. There's loads of loot on the floor. So, 880k. Oh, I'm gonna have to primarily. Nice, nice. Ex motherfucking, motherfucking D. Yes, boys. Anyone? Anyone freezing? Get, get your smites on, guys. Oh my, oh my Yes! <laughs> Run back, get back, get back! Just fuck, fuck that! Fucking go for it! Are you for real? I got like blister. Fuck you now! No way! And just finished PK trip, and now that's 84 crafting. We can do some dragon hide armor, but uh, we're gonna stick with the staffs. Okay, I'm changing it up. I'm doing some diaries because I am bored. Uh, uh, I'm not entirely sure what I've got to do, but I've got to talk to this guy and buy the uh, machete thing, my Bobby. Um, I'm sure it's this guy. Uh, yeah, I'll figure that out, but. Uh, yeah, goodbye, 400k. What, 450, maybe? Yeah, 450. Cool. After literally like 20 minutes of trying to figure out what to do, I uh, think I've figured it out now. Oh, thank God for that. That that was horrible. All that just for a stupid machete, but uh, oh, at least that's that task completed. Oh man, I kind of can't be able to do any more. But Hey, 90 oh, hit points. Oh, oh, whoop, whoop. Oh, you just gotta do it, Annie. You've gotta attack every time. Okay, this should be 83 magic. Beautiful. Um, yeah, this this is this is so easy with mouse keys. So the time has come for me to uh, well take on one of the most difficult bosses in the game. Um, we're gonna go try and do a bit of Corporal Beast and. Uh, see how we do so wish me some luck first kill at court that one too bad oh what no way they're like s oh my god for the first drop that's unbelievable <laughs> oh my days uh, another kill Oh my god, spirit shield, that's not bad, not bad. Ooh. Ooh. No, fuck. That's, that's a good drop. Yeah. That was a good one. Oh, it's in my drop. Yes, it's in my name. It's in my name. I'm happy. 1.5 mil, boys. Woohoo!
Holy elixir, nice. That's 600k. That's alright, that's good. Got 82 attack with that. Two defense. Yeah, yeah, I think I kind of missed that. But yeah, cool, cool. Have I got a level up? Ending on white berries, that is it for court for now. I am doing some more next episode, but uh, I'm probably only just going to show my kills or kills where we earn quite a lot of money. So, uh, yeah, that'll be coming up. And also, next time we are off to Bandos, and uh, let me tell you, we have been and it's crazy, but uh, th there's more in the planning, so it could be even crazier. So, hopefully, you'll tune in for the next video. And uh, yeah, if you did like it, don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you next time.